So today I'm just going to be doing a mini haul. Um, if you can see, my filming location is a little different because I'm actually filming in my brother's room. Um, my room, like right now, the lighting is really bad, so I decided to come in here because my brother's not here right now. But if he finds out, I don't know. I'm just kidding. I don't know. If he sees this video, awkward. Okay, but um, so I'm not gonna keep it long. Um, it's just a mini haul. I've just been, I haven't been shopping much lately, but I've gone to the store and gotten a couple things here and there. So here it goes. Um, first is Ever. Okay, Ever, I'm not sure if they have it in other states um, or other cities where I live. It's kind of like a local boutique and they just have really cute, like trendy in the now stuff. So I went there um, a couple, I think a week ago, and I got this really cute top. It looks just like this. Um, it's actually a cropped. It's supposed to be a cropped sunflower, sunflower top, but the only size they had was a medium, and I really, really liked it because, as you can see, it's like it's just it's very light, and it just has sunflowers over it, and then the material is really like loose fitting for summer, and it has these cute little bows on the top. So I really liked it, and I was really sad that they didn't have it in another size, so I just got a medium, and it cost me ten ninety. Okay. So next is Rapsodiel. It's also a local boutique here. I'm not sure if they have it in other places. But I just got one thing from there, which um, is something I normally don't get. Uh, I got this kind of like cropped tee. It says 23 on it. It's just a normal t-shirt. Like um, It doesn't look so cropped because I got it in XL. Um, it's when I put it on it's not super cropped actually this is actually the last one and I don't know why I got it because I don't usually get clothes with numbers on it but for some reason this shirt reminded me of Miley Cyrus's like 23 is that the name of her song but I just got it I don't know I just got it just because okay so next are these jeans I got um, lucky was having a sale so I got these jeans from Lucky Brand. Um, I've actually used them already, so they kind of look used already. Um, they fit really well. They're the um, Sophia Straight. And when I was there, I was trying to find something. Um, I was trying to find um, skinnies, but these were the closest I got. And as you can see, like I folded the ends right here because I am really short, and these jeans are so long. Like literally, I had to fold it two times in order for me to wear it without tripping because um, it's just really long. But it's really comfortable. Like I've used it twice. And I hate jeans, like I hate wearing jeans and I, I try to stick to dresses and skirts but these jeans make me want to wear next, jeans. Um, I actually took them out from their um, casing but next I got this red striped, uh, red and white striped dress. It looks really nautical. It's just like this. And it's just stripe, and then it has a cinch over here. It's kind of like an A-line cinch, and it just goes down. Um, it's not a maxi dress. Uh, it's just a regular type dress. It looks just like that. And um, it's really funny because in my in my last haul, I think I showed that I got a dress similar to it, which is this one. It's a long maxi dress. But I saw this in the store and I was like, hey, even if I have this dress already at home, this one has a pocket right there. And I think it's just an unspoken girl rule that if a shirt or anything has a pocket, you must get it. And I don't know, I really like stripes, so I got it, even though if I have the same exact thing. Well, this one doesn't look as much as that, so this is the, the stripes on here are bigger than that. I think something's going on with this room it has it keeps making sounds it's scaring me oh and there goes my phone okay next is this maxi dress it's just this purple and like gray striped maxi dress 
and it just goes all the way down. There's no cinch or anything, it just goes straight down. Um, I've actually used this and it feels so, so comfortable and I just really like it. I, I've i been starting to buy more maxi dresses lately and if you can see like the next one is a maxi dress too and I just like the way they feel especially since I when I bought this it was still kind of, well it's still kind of cold here but it's my excuse like I hate using pants so I can use this maxi dress kind of like something to shield my legs if I don't want to show too much leg and it's just really nice fitting okay next is another maxi dress because I am obsessed with maxi dresses now apparently and stripes so if you've noticed all the dresses I've shown you so far are stripes because all the dresses I bought were stripes so this maxi dress is just this black in I think it's like charcoal gray and black striped maxi dress it has a V line for the neck and then it has like three fourths is this what you call it three fourths sleeves I'm not sure and then um, it has a cinched waist up here um, like an A-line empire waist type thing and it just goes down it's really long and I got it in a size small but it's still super long I think I have to wear like wedges or like some type of heel with this because I'll probably trip if I don't wear them but yeah this one is really nice and it's comfy and I haven't used it yet but since I'm making this haul video now now I can use it so yeah okay next is some beauty products okay so first I got this Neutrogena oil free cleansing wipes in pink grapefruit and act for acne prone skin which I don't really know why I got it because I'm not I don't really have any acne um, originally I thought this was um, for uh, like makeup makeup remover wipes because my friend had it and I was like oh hey let me okay seriously that sound is scaring me what is that okay um, so I bought this because I saw my friend had it but then apparently I looked it up and it was not um, for removing makeup and it really made my eye like watery and it feels so chemically like I can feel my eyes watering and stinging when I put it near my eyes so I, I bought this but I stopped using it um I don't really need it so I'm probably just gonna put it aside until I, I don't know I'm just I don't know I don't know what I'll do with it yet so I went to the store and bought this because it's an actual makeup remover, the other one wasn't. And it's the Deep Clean Oil-Free Makeup Remover Cleansing Wipe from Neutrogena. And sadly, I don't like this one either because um, I figured out that the oil-free ones are more like acidic, I think. And when I put it near my eye, it really hurts my eyes. So I'm not sure, I've only been using this for three days. I think I'm just gonna go back to my original makeup remover wipes because I don't really use my makeup remover wipes for anything else because I don't use much makeup other than my eyeliner and mascara. So I'm just going to go back to the blue one that's the um, the cleanser, the makeup remover, um, moist towels I think. It's the blue one. I, I showed it in my last video. So I'll just go back to that because I'm not really satisfied with this one. So yeah. Okay, next is nail polish. Okay. So lately, I've been buying a lot of nail polish. I don't know why. I think, I mean, last, like two summers ago, I had an obsession with, like, buying sunglasses. And I think now my new obsession is, is buying nail polish. Because I've literally bought, like, so well, Lately, much. I've been wanting to do my nails a lot more. I'm not sure why. And when I go to the store, I just... Like, I'm attracted to the nail polish aisle, just, like, instantaneously. So, um, these nail polishes I've gotten over the course of, like, a week or two. And it's been from a couple different stores, but, like, I've gotten at, like, Walmart, CVS, Marshalls, I think Target, I'm not sure. But, um, they're just, like, all the nail polish brands you're kind of, um, used to hearing about. So, first I'm going to start with my Essie nail polishes that I've gotten. And, okay. So... I've never gotten Essie nail polish before and because I really like the way they look, this, this square little, I just like the way it looks so I decided to try it. So the first one I got was a, um, what, what is it called, Mod Square. It's kind of like a pink bubblegum-ish color, um, yeah. 
And then next I got, I'm going to go in the color spectrum order kind of thing. I got Angora Cardi. So it just looks just like that. that. Um, it's kind of like a darker purple. I don't want to say purple. It's like plumish. Um, I have it on right now, but don't look at my nails. It's like really ugly right now because I do my nails every Sunday and it's Sunday today. So I'm going to do them, but they're really ugly right now. They're chipped and stuff. So I'm going to change colors. Um, but yeah, this one is the one I'm currently wearing and it's just this color. Okay, next I have Playdate and it looks just like that. It's a kind of a lilac purple and I really, really like this, especially since it's springtime and I feel like this is, this just, this color just makes me feel like a girl jumping in the meadows and stuff. Okay. Next is Naughty Nautical, which I really like the color of this. It really, really reminds me of the beach and the ocean and just everything. Even if it's not really the color of the ocean, because it's kind of like a turquoise color. Um, but I just really like it. I haven't tried it yet. I just actually just bought it recently. And then next I have Turquoise and Caicos. And it's basically just a, like a lighter shade of that. It's kind of like a mint type color. Um, I like, I don't really know why I bought it. I just, I like the color. So I've been by I've been leaning towards more spring colors lately because when I got the Angora Cardi, my mom literally told me, she, she asked me, she's like, why is your nails so dark? Like, why are they so dark? It's, it's almost spring and you're still having like dark colored nails. And so I was like, okay, I'll go buy spring colored nail polish, I guess, mom. Okay. So next is this one I got from Marshalls. It's in the brand Seation. I don't know how to pronounce it. It's a Seation nail lacquer. Um, it's in the color Super Natural Powers, and it's just basically another purple-ish color. I, I don't want to focus it because it makes weird sounds when I focus it, but it's in this purple color. Um, next I got this Jordana nail polish in the color Pink Bunny. So it's just another pink. It's very pastel-y and it looks just like that. Okay. Next, okay, let me just put these nail polishes back. Next I got, um, in the brand Sinful Colors, first I got this Soulmate in this color. It's kind of just like a peachy pink kind of like I don't know like salmon pink I'm not really sure what color to call it but it looks just like that um it stays really true to color I actually this was my nail color a couple days ago so yeah I got that and then next I got one in rise and shine um it looks just like that it's kind of like a darker like harder not very pastel it's like it's mint, but not really pastel mint, so like kind of like blue-green, I think. And then next I got Savage, which is just this blue, like it kind of looks like electric blue, but, it, but it's not neon, so it's just, yeah, like that. And then next I got Sally Hansen Hard As Nails Extreme Wear. They're actually having a two for five sale at Walmart, so I was like, hey, why not? So I got this in Mellow Yellow, which I don't really get yellow. I've ne I don't have a nail polish in the color yellow. So I decided to try something new because why not, okay? So next I got this um, Bold Gold, with, which is just like gold sparkles, which I know I will regret because sparkles are the hardest thing to take off. But um, I got this uh, bold gold just to go with the yellow because what I'm planning to do is paint it and then paint the gold over it so it looks all princessy and sparkly. Okay, and I think that's it for today. Um, like I said, I haven't really been shopping lately mostly because I'm broke and clothes are expensive so I haven't gone shopping lately um, but that's it for today thank you so much for watching my video and I appreciate all your love and support <laughs> so um, okay that was crazy a little uh, but 
follow me on Instagram at XOXOPaula or follow me on Twitter and tweet me stuff you would like me to make videos of or comment down below it, what you think about my haul and if you have any nail polish suggestions suggestions if you have any nail polish suggestions I can't say that word right if you have any nail polish suggestions okay suggestions um, especially in the Essie nail polish collection because that's becoming my new obsession I really like Essie and yeah just comment down below what your favorite colors are and let me know um, yeah so leave a comment down below of what you would like me to make a video of next and I'll see you guys later Bye!